We call it distance learning, this sudden shift to virtual education, to living and learning together in our homes, to involving family in the educational process. We're sharing technology and workspace and meals and more moments than ever before. So is it really distance learning or is it more like connected learning? Here at Sanford School, we're calling it Sanford Connected, our thoughtful, strategic approach to virtual education because we think this period of connected learning can have a silver lining, as long as we work together and support each other. So how can families make the most of this unusual and challenging time? First, manage expectations. The school day looks very different than it did a few months ago. Expect students to have moments of struggle. Be flexible. Let students take breaks from their schoolwork and their screens. If your student gets stressed, try mindfulness exercises play a board game, take a deep breath, and then try again. Next, establish a productive workspace. The kitchen counter may be the perfect place for homework, but not for an entire school day, especially if the whole family is home. Find a quiet space for your student to focus, spread out, and have access to an outlet to charge their devices. You can even have different workspaces in the morning and afternoon to break up the day. You also want to stay organized. Starting the day off right can help students stay on track all day. Prepare young students' school materials in advance and create a checklist to make sure work is not missed. For a more interactive checklist, students can write each task on a post-it, stick them in their work area, and toss them in the trash when they finish. Another tip, manage time wisely. Without the normal structure of school, some students might spend all day working, while others might spend five minutes writing an essay that was supposed to take half an hour. Use a clock to ensure your student is following teacher recommendations and break the day into 15 to 20 minute chunks of time, assigning specific tasks to each block. It's also important to keep students connected and to get them outside. Use video conferencing to schedule virtual play dates and try to find at least one academic activity that can be done outdoors. Finally, if you need assistance with learning from home, you can count on your Sanford family to help. Email your students' teachers if you have questions, or reach out to your child's counselor if they are feeling overwhelmed. This situation is new to everyone, and we are all in this together. As long as we stay Sanford connected, we can transform distance learning into a time of true connection for all of us.